fourth session of the 14th Nagaland Legislative Assembly. Ajalaga Din Bra Shirgrushin, 9.30 a.m. Bra. Ajalaga Din Day, first Din Day, Nagaland Laga Governor, La Ganesan, Ahigena, Houseke, Etres Gurishe. Ajalaga Din Day, Nagaland Assembly Laga, Nutun Deputy Speaker B. Elect Gurishe, Aro Nationalist Congress Party, Laga MLA S. Toeho Yepto, Tage. Unanimously, Nutun Deputy Speaker Elect Grushe will not be up and get an idea. Amiganaga Nagaland Chief Minister Nipirio Bra Houseke address Kura Homoe, Janai Di Shegi NCP Laga Emile Estoy Hodu, although he is a first timer, Taidu Public Service Laga Domain, the rich experience Lugina Ahia Segunai to Janai Di She. Nutun Deputy Speaker Estoy Ho Yepto, Taira Houseke address Kura Homoe. Talaga Kushi Aro thanks Chana Dishe, CM Rio, Aro legislators Kange, Aro Tai Gushiki, Tailaga, best ability de Tai Kam du Kurina Chavogona, Chana Dishe. Nationalist Congress Party Laga MLA, as Toeho Yeptodu, Tai Suruhoto Assembly Constituency under Zinebodo District Lagase, Aibi Amikan Aji, first in NLS session do Ekbar Silo. Speaker, sir, I rise to felicitate Sri S. Toyho Yiptami, Honorable Emily, on his election to the Office of Deputy Speaker of the 14th Nagaland Legislative Assembly today. Although I first time here in this house, Sri S. Toyho Yiptami had has had a rich experience in the domain of public service. He has served as a leader of various students' organizations in his youth. He also had served as chairman of Village Council Chekia, one of the biggest villages in Dimapur district, a general secretary of Chamukidima Area Village Council Association and advisor of the Mahabur District Village Council. Sir, he is not only good in handling public affairs, but has been very successful in business. And also, I found him to be a progressive farmer also. And in his maiden contest in the political field, he was su successful with a mandate, a comfortable mandate he carried with him. The very fact that he has been elected to this August House unanimously is an indication of the confidence of the House reposed on him. I also take this opportunity to thank all the honorable members of this August House for their cooperation and thereby enabling this House to elect our Deputy Speaker unanimously. Under the guidance of our experienced and efficient Speaker, I have firm confidence that C.S. Toeho Yutomi, with his background, in public service and his vibrant personality in all fields will have no problem in picking up the ropes of his new office and functioning as a good and efficient deputy speaker. In 
parliamentary democracy, the elected government is answerable to the legislative assembly. And the government has to enjoy the confidence of the House at all times. The legislative assembly exercises its control on the government by making laws and regulations for the government. It also exercises its control on the government through assembly questions, debate, and discussions. Assembly resolutions, as well as through its various house committees, under the leadership of our experienced speaker, the new energetic deputy speaker, I hope that this house will perform all these functions in a smooth and effective manner. On my own behalf and on behalf of the members of this August House, I congratulate Sri S. Toyo Yepto on his unanimous election to the office of deputy speaker of the 14th Nagaland Legislative Assembly. I assure him of my constant support and cooperation in the discharge of his constitutional duties and functions. Thank you. Thank you, Honorable Speaker, sir, for giving me the opportunity to express my gratitude to this August House. First of all, I praise the Almighty God for his continued grace and sustenance, enabling me today to stand here in front of and among the most honored leaders of the state. No words are enough to express how grateful I am to the Honorable Leader of the House, Sri Nepirio, the Honorable Chief Minister, the two Honorable Deputy Chief Ministers, Honorable Ministers, Honorable Advisors, and Honorable Members for bestowing upon me the honor and electing me unopposed to the prestigious chair of the British Speaker in the 14th Nagaland Legislative Assembly. I would like to personally thank Honorable Chief Minister for his kind words, felicitation conferred on me. Honorable members, in all humility, I humbly accept, I graciously accept the Constitutional Chair of the Deputy Speaker of the 14th Nagaland Legislative Assembly as per the verdict of this August House. Honorable members, may kindly note that I am a novice in this August House and I have limitations in the parliamentary practices and conventions. However, I am very, very fortunate to have a good master in the form of Sri Shangar Nokomar, who has all the knowledge and experiences in the proceedings of this August House, under whom I shall learn and perform my duties to the best of my abilities, as per your trust and confidence bestowed on me. Honorable members, let us once again remind ourselves that this is a 60-year-old law house. It's a matured house. It, this house has come of age, and the high standard set by our predecessors must be maintained, upholding the prestige dignity, decency, and decorum. Honorable members, I would like to assure the House that I shall perform my duties and functions in all sincerity, with integrity and impartiality, preserving the rich traditions of this August House. I thank our Honorable Leader of the House once again Thank you, honorable members. Thank you, Speaker Sir.